What is up, everybody? Welcome to my channel. I am your boy, DJ, a.k.a. Token Black Guy. My headphones are falling off, but if you're here for the first time, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Uh, this will be the first video, I guess, the month of November. Um, we got through October. Make sure you go back and check, watch all the short horror films that we uh, checked out. But kind of want to get back to some of the things I started off on this channel with, something I like doing a lot. And one of those is Metaball Studios. Love this channel. They always do the perspective things where they give you the size comparison of certain things like video game maps or mech sizes and planet sizes or like if an asteroid hit or like crater on other planets and everything. But this one is spaceship sizes. I do believe we've done one like this before, but this one is from first person view. So if you were looking up at the spaceship from your point of view, how big how big would it look? I think the last time they did like a just a general size comparison of the ships but like i said i love these kind of videos it's just things i like to do so come along and let's check this bad boy out here we go let's see what they got for us back in new york all right lego okay so my kind of day panning the camera that's from men in black Uh, what is this? Oh, that's how big uh, um, the Dragon Ball uh, pod was? Okay. I don't know what this movie is this. Oh, Rick and Morty. Rick and Morty. Uh, is that, oh, that big? Okay. He's a little bit bigger than that. Ratchet and Clank. Love that game back in the day. Hmm. I wasn't ever bigger than that. Is that Master Chief right there? That was Master Chief. <laughs> Alright, so I never really watched Babylon 5 back in the day. That's an old, old show. Is that X-Wing? I'm liking the even the effects they have with like the the, the grass stuff moving it fast over. It's pretty cool. Alright, slave one. See. I see my data would be bigger though. This is from, um, I know that movie, E.T., yeah. I know, I know that movie, E.T., one of the most iconic movies ever. All right, what else we got? What's next? What's next? Oh, the Cosmo, the documentary show. I was like, what the hell is that? A Pelican, here we go. They're going to pick up Chief. I saw Max Chief on the dock right there. Okay, that looks about how big I think it would be. I'm loving the animation. Oh, Millennium Falcon, here we go. No, that. No, I guess that's about the size of it, right? I'm loving the animation this one. I had got the movement. That, if you've never seen that movie, Mars Attacks, um, very funny. Underrated, very funny. It's Futurama. Love that show, by the way. I'm not too fan of the new episodes, though. What is this? I started watching this show. I might go back after playing Starfield. I think I might go watch go back and watch that. Make sure you go over to uh, Metaball Studio channel and subscribe to your channel. They do some good stuff over there. And subscribe to my channel too. 1010. Oh, 1010. I know. I remember watching as a kid here and there. I'm going to get the big ones like the Independence Day ship. What is this? Oh, Interstellar? No, that shit was bigger than that, wasn't it? That gotta be bigger than 64 meters. No, Milano, okay, that seems about right. Yeah, I guess we could compare that to that ship down there. I'm, I'm looking at a naval ship now in the boat. Where we going? I thought, I thought that would be bigger. Perspective wise, I don't know. Oh, I'm trying to think what. <laughs> you know that look like the shocker on that on the left side. It got the, <laughs> the like that, whatever. Can't even do it. Wow, I'm trying to go that long. Okay. I guess the person's throwing me off. A little bigger than that, cause that lamp pole. Oh, Mass Effect. I never really played Mass Effect that much.
I know I know the Yamato the Yamato is the actual naval ship from World War II, but I didn't have a space one. Star Trek Enterprise. Always oh, looks like that'd be bigger. That's gotta be bigger than that. Cause that person that holds like a lot of people on that ship. I thought I was Ferris wheel for a second. Master Chief! Close encounter the third time. So I want to get the real big ones because I feel like those are massive. Because like, I feel like these hu human, that little person on the dock is just not showing the. Um, what is this? I never seen that movie Passengers. Oh, what is that one? Never seen Foundation. All right, I, I want to get like a city size one to see comparison. Global Tech. That, that, see, that's not a kilometer. There's no way that's a full kilometer compared to that person. A, a kilometer would be like across the, the bay, right? Right? Okay, now, 1.2 kilometers. Well, how far is the bay from what, Jersey side to the, uh, New York? It's not a kilometer, is it? Yeah, there's no way that that, that person's the right size. I'm sorry, because that thing, those things hold hundreds of people. Okay, yeah. Let me see what this one compared to the person. Oh, yeah, Arthur, how, how high in the air are they? So now, that, that, but still, I guess, I guess because I'm close to that person, from perspective, the, the, the person is throwing me off a little bit. Size comparison. I feel like, oh, these things hold a lot of people, but I don't know. I'm overthinking it right now, but I am enjoying the visuals. Amazing graphics. What the hell? See, now, now, now it's off because I feel like that thing's that big. Master Chief would look tiny against that thing. And that's three kilometers. Still think the perspective is a tiny bit off, if you ask me. Still, visuals look amazing, though. Wally, you know I've never seen Wally. It's a uh, the pillar of autumn. No, Infinity, Infinity. You know I know that that. Yeah, it, it, see now when I'm sitting the building in the background, it makes sense because that thing's way bigger than a uh, uh, One World Trade now. And look at the building instead of the person. The person's throwing me off. Oh yeah, can, I see it now. Compared to the city, the skyline, it makes perfect sense. If we're looking at the person, that's throwing me off. Whoa, there we go. Now we get big boys. Destiny 2, the traveler. Okay, that looks more like it. Now that I'm focused on the skyline in the back, it looks way more in perspective. That okay, that is huge, massive. Independence Day, yeah, I about to say that's very familiar, right? <laughs> yeah, all over New York. What building was over in what, the Empire State Building in um in uh, Independence Day? And it blew up first. As a Covenant cruiser. See, I never, I never played Mass Effect, so. Shit was funky. <laughs> I'm waiting for the planet size one. Whoa, Oblivion? <laughs> Massive. All that complaining I did at the beginning of the video, now I'm, we're gonna build it in the background and make it perfect sense. Should have focused on that to begin with. It's the size of the moon, so yeah. Like a freaking. It's mm, like <laughs> skirt the bottom of the, <laughs> the building, knock the tower off. 
Yeah, that blocks out the sun for a second. How big are we gonna go? We're gonna go like high charity, those kind of those things, planet size. So we got a little more. We got a little, pretty much two more minutes of the video. They're going all out. I will say, compared to the last version they did, where you just look down at them, this is way better. Yeah, okay, there's high charity. Damn, that looks like a damn um, a planet going by. The mothers. Is that the one from the, in the first one? Because the first, the second one it was like on top of the planet, in that garbage badge movie. Star base killer. That's a planet right there. Full blown planet. Never played Warhammer. How big is this bad boy? I like how <laughs> Matt Sheep he put his arms out. Like, come to me. What's, what's this? Oh, Dreadnought. I need to go back to Destiny. I've been, I've been away from Destiny for a long time. What do we got next? What's the next big boy? Probably what was the biggest one they had in the last video? Halo? Yep. Okay, that, that could encompass the whole Earth plus some, right? That last one? Cool. The last one was just like the 3D version of it, but this one is like the full blown uh your perspective of it. So yeah. Really enjoyed that video. Like I said, Metal Ball Studios, they do some very good videos to give you a perspective of things um, from fantasy to real war, real, real world stuff that you just you really can't comprehend till you kind of visually see it. And um, kudos to them for doing this kind of stuff. I will say my fault for not really paying attention to the the skyline in the back to get the size of the first in the first part of the video. I was focusing on that person for some reason and it kind of drew me off. It makes more sense because you know, when you're close to something, it's bigger than, you know, whatever. But really enjoyed this video. Loved how they flew in and flew out to give you an idea how, you know, the full scope of each spaceship and everything. Um, but, yeah, I really enjoyed these videos. Like I said, trying to get back some of the things in this channel that I enjoy doing and that got this channel started off um, with stuff like that. And this some stupid stuff that I like to watch and everything. So if you're like me and you enjoy stuff like this, is random stuff like this, come on over, hit the like button, subscribe. If there anyone that here surprised you or you wish you would have saw in here, leave a comment down below. Um, until next time, guys, y'all have a good one, and I'll see you when I see you. Peace.